part of the international project of La Liga. In my case, I'm covering Egypt, uh, Libya and Sudan. Of course, it would be amazing. We have Mo Salah playing uh, in La Liga. And of course, other players like Abu Trika, Shikabala, Ukeda. So of course, they are important names. I mean, I'm, I'm super aware of the of uh, the the fan base that Al Ahli and Zamalek has. I moved here two years ago. At the beginning, you never know what to expect. So I came here, I moved in. And uh, the first couple of weeks, I really didn't know what to expect. So I started to build my community, meet friends and so on. And after that, I really started to enjoy my, my time here. And actually now, after two years, now it's, it's home. Part of the international project of La Liga is started in 2017. Uh, so I'm part of the 44 delegates that we have around the world. Uh, we are actually covering 90 countries. In my case, I'm covering Egypt, uh, Libya and Sudan. So we basically want to uh, build a brand. We want to get the brand closer to the, to the fans and we want to build relationships. We want to meet our partners, potential stakeholders and build our brand uh, here in Egypt. Okay, as I mentioned, we want to build a brand and we, and we can do this through uh, different activities. We can go as creative as we want. Uh, me personally, I want to target youth. I want to engage with uh, schools, university, maybe do some tournaments and so on. And we can also do that with different uh, sports. Me personally, I, I love paddle. Uh, so I want to do something around, around paddle in this case, but we can, we can actually do uh, anything with other sports like bas basketball or handball, for example. Okay, I wouldn't say annoying. It, for, of course, it would be better for me if we have Mo Salah playing in, uh, in, uh, in La Liga. Uh, but we, what we are aiming to do is basically build this brand al around all the clubs of, uh, of La Liga. We, uh, we don't want to make it uh, as uh, one thing for a player, you know, like we want to build uh, things around our clubs and around La Liga itself. So, of course, it would be amazing if we have Mo Salah playing uh, in La Liga. But uh, that's not the, the important part about, about us. I mean, it's, it's a fact that Barcelona, Real Madrid, Atleti, uh, these are the most uh, supported uh, clubs all over the world, not only in Egypt. And, and we know uh, Egypt has a, a huge uh, football culture. And even if it doesn't look like, we have a huge uh, fan base here in Egypt for other clubs, like Real Sociedad, Betis, Celta. Um, so what we want to do is we want to connect them with their clubs. I think it's a, it's a good opportunity to, to let them know that uh, they are supported by the clubs and also telling the clubs that they have a huge face ban in Egypt. Uh, so what we want to do is actually do activities around these clubs that are less known than the main three that we have in La Liga. So I want actually to focus on this. We want to do uh, things around El Derby Vasco or El Gran Derby de Sevilla. So these are important things for us. I mean, me personally, I'm very happy about it. Uh, that's what's encouraging me actually to keep doing activities here in Egypt, because as I said, we, uh, here in Egypt, there is a huge football culture. So that's what's uh, that's supporting us and helping us to keep building this community and this fan base here in Egypt. That's actually very, very cool for us. I mean, I'm, I'm super aware of the of uh, the the fan base that Al Ahli and Zamalek has. Um, of course, I know other teams that are playing very well now, Pyramid Set, um, Future as well. And of course, important players like Moussala, Shinawi, uh, Zizou or Mohamed Sidan, Masalan, all, uh, and also all the old players as well. Um, in this case, actually, Mohamed Sidan, um, there's uh, a story behind this because uh, you know, there's this uh, tournament happening every year in, in, in Cairo. It's called Diplomatic Cup. So last year I was supporting my Spanish friends. They were playing against Germany, where we found Mohamed Sidan playing there. And of course we lost this match. So I had the pleasure to meet uh, Sidan and, uh, and I remember him very well. And of course other players like Abu Trika, Shikabala, Ukeda. So of course they are important names. Shukran Gid and Gemabegad. I'm very happy to be here. Thank you.